I ended the fucking video. Gloomy or not gloomy, it is so beautiful here and I'm so grateful to be here. Um, You guys, we do got to talk though because Selena Gomez has opened up about a lot of things in a new interview with a, a magazine called Fast Company. So we got to talk about that. So before we do, grab a snack and a drink and hit that subscribe button, girl. Let me know what you are snacking on, bitch. Also, let me know what is your favorite go-to. Let me just put you over here because my husband just showered and I think he's going to come out and this is not OnlyFans, okay, bitch? Um, anyways, what was I saying? Oh, let me know what airport snacks you like. Let me know in the comments. I'm I'm very curious. Okay, girl, we got to talk. Um, So do you guys remember when Selena Gomez woke up one morning and was like, <laughs> goodbye, Gigi Hadid. <laughs> goodbye, uh, what Bella Hadid. <laughs> goodbye, Dua Pipa. You know, remember when she uh, deleted Dua Lipa from her Instagram and everybody was talking about it and, and Dua Lipa was like, watch me. Damn, she deleted me, dancing night away. What do you mean she did? She unfollowed me, da, da, da. you know, uh, okay. Um, so everyone made such a huge deal about it. But I mean, to me, it made sense. You know, Dua Lipa dated Anwar, which is obviously Gigi and Bella's um, brother. And, um, you know, The Weeknd and all that, you know, Zayn, you know, all that mess. She deleted Zayn too. She unfollowed Zayn, blah, blah, blah. So... Everyone was, like, talking about it, and everyone was like, oh, my God, what happened? Like, you know, this is so crazy. What is the drama? You know, Dua Lipa's not even dating Anwar anymore. Like, you know, why did, why, what happened? So we finally got word of exactly what happened. But I have to tell you guys something. I feel a certain way about this. So let's talk. So she asked, she was asked what happened with Dua Lipa, and she responded and said, it was an accident. I was just cleaning up some of my Instagram. Then somebody called me and was like, what happened with Dua? Nothing. And Gomez went above and beyond to make it publicly clear. Gomez even wore a dress from Versace and Dua Lipa's collaboration to a Rare Beauty event. Okay, so listen, let me tell you guys something. Great, it was an accident, amazing. But what if it wasn't an accident? What if Selena Gomez does not like Dua Lipa? What if Selena Gomez does not like certain people? I don't understand why in 2023 we have to pretend to like everybody. You know what I mean? Like we have to pretend, well, especially I feel like in the music industry or in that industry, it, nobody like has like, it kind of feels like nobody has the right to have true feelings, if that makes sense. And like, you know what? Maybe some people are just not meant to be in your life. Maybe some people are you don't want to see. Maybe some people you feel a certain way about. And I just don't think it's fair that, you know, I'm, I'm not saying this is Selena Gomez and Dua Lipa, but I'm saying I don't think it's fair that, you know, people should even be questioned about if they unfollowed somebody. Let me tell you something about unfollowing somebody. I, I'm going through a place in my life as well where, you know, if a friend is not a real friend and who I feel that we have not been there for each other and it and there's no wanting to be there for each other or if I'm trying and they're not giving what I what I feel like I deserve because you know once you start loving yourself you start realizing that you also deserve some love and you deserve respect and you deserve you know certain things doesn't mean that your ego is on fire it doesn't mean anything it just means that bitch you know what i feel like i give a lot and you know what in a friendship it's a two-way street you know so i'm not saying it's sad about Dolipa, but it just pisses me off that like she even has to explain like if she wanted to unfollow Dolipa, then fucking unfollow Dolipa. you know what i mean like it is what it is but obviously it was an accident they're friends everything is amazing um but i just feel like damn like imagine the fakery that is actually in hollywood bitch like imagine all the people that do not like each other but cannot unfollow each other uh, because then it's gonna cause this huge thing. You know what I mean? I'm like, girl, listen, if you don't like a bitch, fucking just unfollow, okay? Who cares? Like, it really is like that. And the older you get, the less time you have for bullshit. You know, I don't know if it's the foggy weather that has me like this, bitch, but I'm I'm feeling very cutthroat, girl, okay? Um, 
follow. No, but listen, for real. So, I mean, I'm glad she did, you know, um, clear it up. Because I remember when all of this was happening, everyone was like, Dua Lipa's not even dating Anwar. Uh, Selena Gomez is being frantic. Selena Gomez is being this. Selena Gomez is being that. Like, I'm, I was so tired. You know what it is? I wonder what she does when she sees all of these things. And all these narratives that people come up with. Like, all of these very crazy stories i remember back in the day it was like you know dua lipa dated anwar years ago she 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 then no i don't think they can see she then you know unfollowed um she then dated anwar then you know they broke up and then she went with i don't know who she's actually been dating who has she been dating I don't even know. Oh, is this like rich guy? I don't know. Anyways, so she has nothing to do with the Bella Hadid and the Gigi Hadid and the Anwar Hadid and no Hadid, okay? And, you know, of course, people were like, you know, doing the math and being like, well, Dua Lipa's not with Anwar. Like, Selena Gomez is being so frantic. I was just like, oh, my God. What if she's not being frantic? What if Dua Lipa's a bitch and she doesn't like Dua Lipa? Like, who cares? But I don't see Dua Lipa being a mean girl. Do you? Like, there's some certain people that, like, you can, you can like, tell who's nice and who's not nice and Dua Lipa seems to me like she's a really nice girl but that's just my opinion bitch um but what do you guys think let me know in the comments I'm glad she cleared it up though um because it was a huge mystery honestly everyone was like up in arms I remember doing the video and everyone was like oh my god Dua Lipa I'm like girl bye anyways um what do you guys think let me know in the comments I love you all very much I'm gonna leave you guys with a really cute little vlog I did um here in Tokyo so I hope you enjoy it I hope you know how grateful I am for you I have to go get ready now um i don't know if i told you guys but um so i had to i had to hang my clothes I, that's like my sweater right here hanging on my luggage and my the, because i last night i was like you know they've been in my luggage for some time and i wanted to wear them today so i was like i'm gonna you know put them outside so they can you know get some air girl tell me why i fell asleep and then it rained and it was like my literally my clothes is like let the rain fall down and it's drenched it's like you know wap it's like clothes but in the wap version no wap in the clothes version i swear it's like super fucking cold uh, it's cold and 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 i already closed all my luggages everything is like well i did my husband did everything is so neatly like i don't know what i'm so if you see me walking in the damn japan airport looking crazy and wet bitch just pretend it's a new fashion look from japan okay anyways girl i love you all very much thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye Aquí la foto es chévere. Uno se toma la foto con eso, ¿verdad? salido que está rompiendo la bolsa eh. ah, eso era del candy apple será
Ah, it smells cigarettes. 